Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to create email automations with the help of MailChimp. So first of all, what you have to do is go to MailChimp.com and sign in with your account once you're signed in. What you have to do is click on this automation button here. A drop down menu will appear where you land on overview page. So from there, what you have to do is create or you can also uh, choose pre-build journey or you can also build from scratch. So today we are going to build from scratch. I'll click on it. Now you can give it any name. For example, I will name it as sample and click on stop building. Again, a new page will open. Now we have to choose a starting point from which if this starting point has something, for example, if I click on it, there are so many options like there are some popular tag added, sign up for email, buy a specific product, contact activity. There are so many options you can select and choose from. So if I go to the popular section, for example, if I want to create a sequence for if anyone buys a product, I want to send them an email about thank you for shopping with us, something like that. So I will click on buy the specific product, I'll click on it. Now I will add my product name. I have some products over here. For example, I will click on this product and click on save it as a starting point. Now, if anyone buys this specific product, what I can do, I will click on add the journey. I want to send him the email. We'll click on add journey. Now there are some options like send in, sending emails, sending SMS, web hooks. So simply I will click on send email. Now from there to their email from my email, design your email by starting with a template. So I will select any temp template, for example, and on this page, what you can do, there are all templates, basic layout, fully designed, saved templates, recently sent drafts and create code your own. I can also code my own template as well. So there are some styles, min minimalist, bold, colorful, neutral, light, industry, select arts and finance, whatever. There are also some email purpose, something like announce, newsletter. This is a helpful tool. So service there is a thank you section. So I will click on thank you because I'm creating a thank you email address. So I will select thank you discount button. I will click on preview and check enjoy 20% off your first purchase. So this is this sounds like a good email. I will cl click on continue to builder. If you do not like this, I, you have to click on exit preview. I will click on continue because I like this template. Now what you can do enter your or upload the picture of your product over here. For example, thank you for shopping with us uh, it's written thank you for signing up so what i will do i will thank you for shopping with us and on your second purchase because he has already made his fir first uh, purchase so i will write it as enjoy 20 percent off your second purchase and if i click on this image i can replace this image with the product that the uh, person or the customer has bought from me so I will click on browse images and upload the image of my product over here and enjoy 20% off your second purchase though. So, so I can also um, write with an AI what I will do. Click on write with an AI like tell AI what to write. For example, I will type thank you for shopping with us. You will get 20% off your second purchase. I will click on generate and let's see what AI will generate for us. Now, thank you for shopping with us. We are thrilled to offer you 20% off. We are so grateful you choose us. Thanks for being awesome. For I will uh, select this second one. Click on apply. We are so grateful you chose us. Enjoy 20% off your next purchase as a thank you. Shop with joy. Use code save20 at checkout. So this sounds like a friendly so what you have to do once you're done, click on save and return to journey. Once you click on it, you have successfully created your email sequence with the help of MailChimp. If you find this video helpful, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.